Today I'm going to show you how to make a sunglasses case that you affix to your car's visor using elastic. I'll be using two separate types of fabric. Flannel for the inside and then just a woven fabric for the outside. I like to use flannel on the inside because it's soft and it won't scratch your glasses. You can use both the same fabric on the inside and the outside. Just make sure that it's something soft. You're going to need two pieces of for the outer fabrics. Each one is going to be 8 inches by 9.5 inches. And then you're going to need two pieces of fleece or fusible fleece, eight inches by six and a half inches. Today I'm using fusible fleece. Now instead of fusible fleece, I often use just a, a remnant of regular polyester fleece and then cut it to this six and a half by eight and then use this uh, temporary bond basting adhesive to fi fix it to the wrong side of my fabric. That works just as well. Now you're going to need one piece of one inch wide elastic cut to seven and a half inches. Now, the, you're going to attach, we're going to base this to the right side of your outer fabric. And it is, it's a half inch shorter than this length. So it will bunch, bunch it up just a little bit, but that's what you want because we want it to be snug on your visor. So what I do is on the outside, of your outer fabric, measure over two inches from the edge and pin your elastic to that edge and we're just going to base that into place about a quarter inch from the outside edge. Next we're going to put the right sides together and you want to be sure that if you have a fabric that has a directional print that you're you're working at the very top of that piece because we're only going to put the top edges together and sew a half inch seam right across here. All right. I have sewn a half inch seam across that top edge. Now I just want to trim that seam to about a quarter of an inch. and unfold this and then fold it together lengthwise and we're going to do another half inch seam here. All right. Now I have sewn a half inch seam all the way down that length. Now I just want to trim this seam to about a quarter of an inch. Now I need to fold the inner fabric down over the outer fabric. And if you're using the same fabric for both sides, your outer fabric is going to be the one that has the elastic piece affixed to it. So we're just going to roll this down. And just smooth that around that top edge so that 
the seam is right on the edge. And then come down to the bottom. And we're going to match up the, one, the seam right here and just flip that seam allowance one of them in one direction and one in the other direction. And we're going to pin this all the way across. Now one last seam. We're going to just stitch across this opening half an inch. And then we're going to trim it, turn it right side out, and you're finished. All right. Now you see there's my half inch seam. Now on this one, we want to cut at an angle, cut these corners, do not cut your stitching. Just cut it at an angle. And then trim that seam to about a fourth of an inch. Now, you're gonna stick your thumb all the way into that corner. And then put one of your other fingers here and just push that corner in. Do the same thing for the other bottom corner. And then pull that bottom all the way out. 